How's it going, everyone? I'm Philly Number Five Five Five, and welcome back to more Big Brother with Raining Rose. Hi. Yes, hi. All right. This season we will be doing Big Brother High Rule. I can't believe we haven't done this season yet, but we're doing it now. In the past season, we did Big Brother Shippings, which was a great season. I really hope you guys enjoyed that one. But yeah, now we're doing High Rule, which I'm actually really excited to do because we've had this one planned for a long time, but we've never done it. We had to make modifications to our cast for it. Not gonna say why, but we have to. But anyway, I hope you're looking forward to the season. I'm looking forward to it. I'm sure Randy Rose is looking forward to it. Yeah, I am. And yeah, so who are you rooting for? Midna and Tetra. Okay. Like I have not actually fully decided who I'm rooting for other than one person, so I've really got to step it up and figure- No, I have two people. Never mind. I am rooting for Ganondorf, because I love his picture. Who doesn't? And I'm also- What? It's pretty grand. It's so big brother. The face is perfect. But anyway, I'm also rooting for Linebeck, because he's just an awesome character. Everyone else- can just get evicted. <laughs> I mean. But seriously, Ganondorf is my number one. All the way. Alright, so who do you think is winning the first people HOH? people rooting for in the diag diagonal line, what the frick? Oh yeah, that's weird. Who are you Anyways, rooting for? Anyways, I'm going to root for... Not root for, oh for, yeah, for HOH, never mind. Oh, up. that's a tough question, I don't know. Who would, who would get it? Who would be dumb enough to win Darunia? Yes. Because typically, H for the very first HOH is usually a starting off with Endurance. Darunia would win that. He'd want to win that really bad. He's not He's not going to think very logically in this game. He will just win comps. That's what his goal would be. He'll just win everything. He'll win HOH. He'll win a veto. He'll win an HOH. Like, that's all he's going to do. He needs to be comp beast. If he's not, I'm disappointed. I can agree with that logic. I'm going with Darunia. Same. Okay. Link wins head of household. Not exactly what I was expecting, but... Okay. I mean, I, th I would see him trying to win early, too. Yeah. I mean, I could see it. So, sure. Link begins the nomination ceremony. Zelda is safe. Wow. Of course, Zelda's the first person. Zant is safe. Impa is safe. Skull Kid is safe. Darunia is safe. Ruto is, Ruto is safe. Tingle is safe. I'm surprised he didn't put Tingle up, because Tingle is probably very close to Link. Like, just up in his face all the time. Or something. I yeah, could see probably. it. I don't even know how to say his name. Daphnis is safe. <laughs> Ganondorf is safe. Agatha is safe. Linkle is safe. Tetra is safe. Midna is safe. Link nominates Lana and Lineback. Okay. Random. Yeah. I mean, it might just be like that whole uh, social connections. I don't know you much. We didn't get along. Like, that's the best way to go a week one if you're HOH. Just say, I didn't connect with you enough. At least that's what I would think. Even though, if that's the case, I think Ganondorf and Zant should be on the block. Probably. You think they would have been if Link was HOH? Yeah. Oh, we don't get to say how that plays out, so yeah. Link is HOH, and Lana and Linebeck as nominees will compete. Midna, Zant, and Ganondorf are all selected to compete. Go Ganondorf. So you're not going to cheer for Linebeck? Ganondorf can win it and save Linebeck. That's probably not going to happen. Hey, expect the unexpected. I'm not going to expect the unexpected. I'm going to expect the obvious. So you're going to expect the expected? Nope. So you're not going to expect the unexpected or the expected? You're just not going to expect obvious. anything. 
There is no obvious. <laughs> okay, I'm just going with it. Who are you rooting for? Well, since you're not going to cheer for a linebacker, I will. <laughs> well, what if Midnight goes to the block for it? Fine. Okay. Midna wins power of veto. That's cool. Oh dang, I hope this actually is kind of what bleeds out here. Lana and Linebeck state why they should be saved. Midna uses power of veto on Lana. Link names Agatha as the replacement. Final nominees are Agatha and Linebeck. I kind of want Agatha gone first. Out of personal preference. But yeah, she probably freaked everybody out. She's just running up to everyone in the house in the backyard. I know you have bugs. <laughs> yes. Where are you getting them? We're in an isolated house. Actually, <laughs> when a bug sneaks in, it's just like oh, a heyday yeah. for her. <laughs> oh jeez. I mean, it happens. So, okay. Agatha and Linebeck face eviction. Darunia votes to evict Linebeck. Ruto votes to evict Agatha. Ganondorf votes to evict Agatha. Impa votes to evict Linebeck. Linebeck. Wow, that's gonna be hard to say. Maybe he should go. <laughs> Daphnis votes to evict Agatha. Linkle votes to evict Agatha. Lana votes to evict Linebeck. Zant votes to evict Linebeck. Zelda votes for Agatha to be evicted. I didn't say that right. Tetra votes to evict Linebeck. Tingle votes to evict Linebeck, because clearly there can only be one man of the seas. And that's not Tingle. Skull Kid votes to evict Agatha, because Agatha clearly was bothering Skull Kid's fairies. That's what yes, happened. Yes, probably. Midna votes to evict Linebeck. Oh, actually, I don't know what was going on here, but I see more Linebeck on the end page here. I'm not really sure. Let's just find out. Oh, it was close. Agatha close. and Linebeck face eviction. Linebeck is evicted by a vote of 7-6. I mean, he was the odd man out, so. Like, in design-wise. That's why he got out. They didn't like his picture. There was something off about it. <laughs> Ouch. Okay, well, I guess I've only got my boy Ganondorf. That's it. It's my boy. That's it. Okay. Who are you rooting for? I... I don't know. Somebody who I don't want to be a floater, which will probably be... Skull Kid? I don't know. I'm gonna go with... Screw it. Tangle's gonna win Age of Witch. Oh gosh. Info wins head of fold. Okay. Random. Impa begins the nomination ceremony. Darunia is safe. Tingle is safe. Petra is safe. Daph is safe. I don't know how to say her name. But Daph and yes. <laughs> that old guy is safe. <laughs> oh, ouch. Is safe. Link is safe. Ruto is safe. Ganondorf is safe. Skull Kid is safe. Midna is safe. Linkle is safe. Agatha is safe. Impa nominates Zelda and Zant. She doesn't like those Zeds. She should be. She should like Zelda. What the frick? That's what the who's Age of Wage? <laughs> That's how much you know they're not a big player. Uh, okay, Ganondorf likes to be last pick, doesn't he? I guess so. Impa is Age of Wage, and Zelda and Zant as nominees will compete. Tetra, Linkle, and Ganondorf are all selected to compete. Ganondorf. Ganondorf, Ganondorf, Xanth probably gonna win. Better not be quick it. I just did. Okay. Impo wins power of you. Comp beast. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's suitable. So. It is. Sure. Okay. Zelda and Zant state why they should be saved. Impa does not use the power of Vito. Darn, I would have actually hoped that she used it on Zelda. Yeah. Final nominees are Zelda and Zant. Well, what I'm going to theorize is happening, but I don't think it's likely is... Just, this is wishful thinking, but I'm hoping Impa's using Zelda as a pawn, because Zelda seems like she'd be likable in the house. Over Zant. 
Zant would get on people's nerves. So I would like to believe she has Zelda up there so she can more sure that Zant's gonna go. Even though this early in the game, you don't do that. Because pawns go home all the time. Especially in the early game, because the pawn's kind of useless when the boats are everywhere. Yeah. But hey, that's what I'm hoping for. Is that because I mean I don't care if Zack gets evicted. I'm not a fan of his picture anyway. Yeah. All right. Zelda and Zant face eviction. Mana votes to evict Zelda. Petra votes died. to evict Zelda. Yeah. Daphne is. is you want <laughs> him gone? <laughs> I do. I'm gonna get your name mixed up and never be able to say it. Vote. It's not even a hard name either. Votes to evict Zelda. Yeah, it's just Daphne. Skullkid votes to evict Zelda. Darunia votes to evict Zelda. Link votes to evict Zelda. Ganondorf votes to evict Zant. <laughs> <laughs> of all people, everyone else you think would be the other way around, and then Ganondorf. <laughs> Angela yeah. votes to Big Zelda. Ruto votes to Big Zelda. I'm hoping Ganondorf is the odd man out, just because then that makes it seem interesting that he's playing very dangerously. Tingle votes to Big Zelda. Oh. Linkle votes to Big Zant. Midna votes to Big Zelda. That would have yeah. been awesome if Midna voted for Zant. Yeah, but everything was out of whack in that one. Damn. It's official though, Ganondorf and Linkle, they're the alliance. It's it's okay. right there. Zelda and Zant face a victim. Zelda is affected by a vote of 10-2. Wow. She got wrecked. I said pawns go home. That wasn't even a pawn. Nope, not at all. If anything, I think Linebag and Agatha was a pawn situation more. Well, that was the episode. I would say it was okay. I mean, two good people left early, but... I mean, that's fine, I guess, right? Yeah. Sometimes. We, have, we found that Impa is going to possibly be a comp beast. Maybe? I'm okay with that. Clear. Ganondorf is playing risky. I'm okay with that. Like, just look at that face. That's a face of pure risk. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. We will see you next time in more Big Brother. Alright, bye. Bye.